Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. The Brothers Grimm, directed by the visionary Terry Gilliam, had the makings of a classic, with stars like Matt Damon and Heath Ledger at the helm. But what happened? Released in 2005, the film ended up with a dismal 38% rating on Rotten Tomatoes, a stark contrast to Gilliam's typically imaginative projects. This movie faced a tumultuous production surrounded by conflicts, primarily between Gilliam and the infamous Weinstein brothers, who took the reins after MGM dropped the project due to financial issues. Gilliam's creative vision was compromised from the start, impacting everything from casting choices to the film's special effects. His first choice cinematographer was replaced, and inspired casting decisions were overturned, resulting in a production riddled with compromises. As the film transitioned into production, it was plagued by significant changes. For instance, Johnny Depp, Gilliam's original choice for Will Grimm, was replaced with Matt Damon due to studio insistence on star power, which ultimately left the film lacking cohesion and direction. The production also doubled the intended use of CGI effects, leading to spiraling costs and further complicating the film's timeline. When the Brothers Grimm hit theaters, it failed to capture the unique magic and charm that fans expected from Gilliam. Audiences and critics alike noted how the rich talent of the cast was overshadowed by a lack of chemistry and confusion in character direction. Even with the film's intriguing premise of con artist brothers facing real supernatural threats, it lacked the engaging narrative Gilliam was known for. In essence, The Brothers Grimm stands as a cautionary tale about the dangers of studio interference and the loss of creative vision. While it contains flashes of Gilliam's whimsical style, it ultimately struggles with inconsistent tone and character development, leaving viewers longing for the vibrant storytelling that this talented director could have delivered if given full creative freedom. Despite its shortcomings, fans can still find enjoyment in its whimsical attempts, but the film serves as a reminder that sometimes the clash between artistry and business can lead to disappointing results. The Brothers Grimm is currently available to rent on Prime Video, and it might just be worth a watch for those curious about how a promising concept can fall short of greatness. I see.